a more important thing is acting versus reading. So, so, so many people get into this business because they have a nice voice. And I can't tell you how often people will call me and say, I've been told I have a beautiful voice and I want to do voice acting. And I'm like, that's awesome. However, if you don't have acting skills to go along with it, you're going to end up not landing as many auditions because you're, you're just going to sound like you're reading and that's not going to emotionally connect. I always suggest to people spend five to 10 minutes a day kind of in your heart center in an emotion. Often commercials are emotions of joy, their um, playfulness, their calm. And if you spend 10 minutes a day feeling joy and you're doing the laundry while you're feeling joy, now when you get your script, you're able to pick up your script, feel those feelings and immediately slide right in. And new voice actors that are not landing things all the time, half the time, more than half the time, my very first question is, who are you talking to? And they go, oh, I didn't think of that. And I'm like, that's one of the most important things I want you to start thinking about is who are you talking to and how are you going to move them emotionally from your heart center, human to human, to their heart center. We want to really work on acting skills. Another idea could be do some on-camera acting and or maybe some improv. You know, if you go to do something like that, that's another idea to grow those acting skills or work with coach. Um, so that's one thing that I say always can really, really, really help your auditions.